It's for them to learn how to think and how to express themselves. My vocabulary is good, but I need to get my writing and my reading in the same level as my vocabulary. So it's important for me to be here for that reason because next year I'm going to be in 10th grade. I have almost three years till college and I really want to make sure I'm ready for it and prepared for it and I can have a future in America here. Now I know a lot of words uh, and now my pronunciation is better. Now I can talk with my friends and I understand when the people talk in English uh, is the best. I really love it because you play sports and you have academics and they really teach you a lot. You have science, language arts, math. It is a sports program on a college campus with the vision of getting kids to see their future and how they can be on a college campus and what could potentially be their future. The thing that I like the most about is like when people come and participate, have fun. So out here we focus on the body, we play sports, we teach them about leadership, sportsmanship, teamwork. And it's like not like actual school because in the classes you get to like play sports in the classes, not just outside. Like, like in science, we're learning about bones and the things that help you during sports. It's cool, it's fun, a way to kick out the summer. All of my friends are here. The teachers are nice and they do a lot of fun things. What we work on is creating a love of learning and a love of reading in the hearts and minds of our children, starting kindergarten through eighth grade. We also provide our parent empowerment workshops to help our parents to navigate the system, but also have the tools and the confidence to start preparing their students even now for college and career readiness. I liked that you could learn more about like your community, like the history of Rondo. Today's story I'm going to share is about a group of African American men. Each week is a different theme, so it's I can make a difference in myself. So the first week we're kind of teaching about self, and then family, community, and then country, world, and then the last week is with hope, education, and action. Well, he likes to read now, and he likes to do math, and he has more confidence. 